Yes, they're real. They're not mine, but they're real. <laughs> children ran across green fields that touched the horizon. I remember how solidarity reached far over boundaries of race or kin. I remember how we were encouraged by stories of love and justice. I do remember. But now, I am starting to believe that what I remember is nothing but a dream. The wars started, but they did not end. Instead, the green fields were covered with armies, solidarity became a synonymous with race, and the only stories we could encourage our children with were about heroic acts in the midst of battle. As time passed, the reasons for these wars have been long forgotten. People are led by warmongers and tyrants who do not care for politics or negotiations. The only hope we have left for peace is that one faction would be victorious. Unfortunately, the armies have been at an even match since the beginning of the conflicts. Hundreds of years have passed since the first sword fell, and that hope for peace is now an almost faded star. But finally, we, the Alliance, have a small advantage. With just some more strength, with just something, we might end this. We might be able to deal the finishing blow. We await that something. Or someone. Someone that can light up the star room. We await. A legend. I have been released. I have been free from my shackles of this dreadful prison. Now I am calling you, Theodore. You want 